How's that? Are we on? We're live. Are we, are we on? Are we on? We are live and in color. Woohoo! Hi, everybody. All right. Let's see. We don't have anybody here yet. Bam, there's Carrie Vick. Here's everybody coming. Carrie Vick, hello. Okay, there's Amy. There's Paula. Hello. Amy, Paula. Let's get this house jammed. Got some hers sticking out. Hmm? Some hers. The hers sticking out? Hi Cindy. Hi Cindy. Hi Chris. Amy Craven. Thank you. Thank you, Amy. Sandra. Hello. There we go. Lenora, hello. I didn't have church today because the pastor had to do something. Well then you're here. Oh, you're here. Yay! Alright. Hi, Cindy. Hi, Sharon. Talk to the people, I get tape ready. Here. Hi, Sandra. Oh, that's Cindy saying hey to Sandra. Oh, thank you, Carrie. I wanted to wear my fun necklace. It's one of my favorite necklaces, so. And my orange lipstick. My daughter was like, hi, Amy. Who's your diver? All right. My daughter was like, I go, do you like, do I look good? And she goes, mommy, why are your lips orange? I'm like, because they're orange. Hello from Canada, Joanna, or Joanne. Oh, thank you, Amy. We're just getting stuff started. Getting stuff ready here, guys. I probably don't need this right now. I am getting all the tape set. So that when I have to write things down, I'm ready to go. Paradise Finds. Hello from Florida. Hello to Florida. We're just getting organized here. Oh, Paula, I can't, we're excited about it. That's she right. she can't wait to see the look on our face when we open the box. Well, we have the box sitting right down we here. We got it right here. We got it right here, Paula. And we're gonna open it up right here, live, jive, jive. So everybody can see what Paula sent. Hello, Kentucky, Sheila Ross. We got people from all over today. Yay. Right, 20 people already. Let's go. Let's go. Get oh, it. thanks, Lenora. This is at Sensi Stuff. Double D says good luck with the sale. Didn't want to clog up our chat. Who? Double D. Oh, did you say something on there? Good luck with the sale. Didn't want to clog up our chat. All right. Thanks, Double D. We missed you. Hope you're working hard, buddy. It's not clogging up the chat. The more the, more the merrier. That's right. There's something in there for her. Okay. Oh, it's raining in Atlanta. Ooh. Really? It's like crazy good weather here. Right. It's like going to be 98 degrees. On Easter Sunday. On Easter Sunday here in Arizona. So, Cindy. Thank um, you, Sheila Ross. One thing Thanks about for watching. Arizona. Sorry. No, you're fine. One thing about Arizona, guys, is we don't get any hello, spring's coming. We get a two by four up your face that it's hot. Yep. That's it, how we get it, it here. It pretty much hits you in the face. Yeah. It's like, nice, nice. Yeah. Hey, it's hot. <laughs> yeah. North here, old adult film star, great streams tonight. <laughs> Peter North. Guys, thanks, Peter. <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> yeah, Peter North. Peter North. Sure. <laughs> Adult film star. Yeah. <laughs> Made rain badly. It's been beautiful, but super dry. Had a brush filer. Oh, yeah. Atlanta needs some rain then, it sounds like. All right, I got tape set. Look at all that. We got tape ready. I think we're ready to go. Bam. So we're in Virginia. So it sounds like the South is just getting pounded with some rain. Yeah. We've got all kinds of stuff tonight, guys. We got clothes, purses, we got a makeup box, we got a craft box, we've got uh jewelry, we have candles, we have stuffs. So um yeah. So what what should we start with? Um well we're not gonna start with candles. No. I don't know. Let's give it a couple more minutes. We've only got 22 people on there. We'll give it a couple more minutes, guys. See if we can uh, get more people in the house, and then we'll start in the house. And then we'll start selling some stuff. We do have some lots of stuff, so we got lots of stuffs. Disgusting, Mr. North. Is this a joke that I am not privy to? Because Peter, Peter North is a he's big, a famous adult a, a star. Big famous. Adult star. Like Ron Jeremy? Yes. Okay. So <laughs> Start with that box. What box? Oh, open Paula's box. Oh! Should we open Paula's box first? Was right. that Paula that said that? Yeah. So we're going to open okay. this box. We're going to open Paula's box. So one of our awesome fans, Paula, who's like always there and we can always count on her, she sent us an amazing box. box of stuffs. So we're gonna pop this. So we're gonna open. open it in front of you guys and show you just how awesome she is. Ooh, there's lots of stuff sitting on top already. She also sent a bunch of jewelry that we're going to start probably not do this week because we already have a bunch of stuff set up. But we're gonna. Uh, she wants us to auction it off for um, um, Freaking Frugal's uh, GoFundMe account. So we're probably gonna do that um, next weekend. We're probably next. Wednesday we'll start doing this, but we're going to open this card here. It says, may open online and read online. Everything in bags are for my friends. Um, Amy's Fund. So we're going to open this card up here. And it's a nice little card. Oh. You'd be surprised how often I think of you and wish you the very best. You are both so awesome people I've ever met in my life and will always be my friends. Thank you for everything you have done to make my life fun and help me with the wedding. And don't... Don't forget to send oh, the an invoice. On the stuff I have. <laughs> yes, done. Okay. Paula and Jim. Okay, so okay. we got the card. Thank you, Paula. That's such a nice card. So we've got a bunch of jewelry here that she sent, as you guys oh, wow. can see. And I believe she has price lists, so we're going to... It's all numbered. We're not going to do these tonight, though. Really cool. Um, we are going to do Lots these. Of stuff. Yeah, we'll do all these jewelry starting next Ooh, week. Okay, wait. But there's a present here. Is this for Liberty? Oh, I think this is. Liberty. Let's get Liberty. Liberty. Come here, sweetheart. Come here. Lift her up. Come here. We got a package today from Paula and there's something in it for you. <laughs> you got her? Let's lift her up. Let's lift her up. All right, there's Liberty. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, here, I'll get her. <laughs> okay, we got little Liberty here. What's that? It's a little guy. <gasps> no way. It's a... Is it a platypus? Does it have a tail? It is a platypus, it looks like. There's no tail, though. It says Liberty on it. There's no tail. Mm. Let's see what it says. It is a beanie baby. Is it a platypus? I think <gasps> it is. Let's see what the tag says. Perry. He is Perry. Just got a bill like a duck. Hope your friendship brings you luck. It's April's birthday birthday. Um, it doesn't say, but it definitely looks like it's got... I think it's a platypus. Yes, I think it's... It... Ah! Oh, stop dropping it. She got a duck bill oh platypus from Paula. And it's not just any platypus. Yeah. It's got gold, which is so our family. What do you say to Paula? Thank you. 
Isn't that nice of her to give you that? Oh. I forgot to open this. Yeah, Should we open this open now? It. Let's see what that note okay. says. Okay. Read that. What's that say? This note says, this is for your love seat or chair. Oh. Uh oh. Oh. Must be something somebody made for us. Oh. Oh, snap. Wait, 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 wait. That was Liberty. Okay. Oh, she made something for us, didn't she? Oh, yes. my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh. How amazing. Wow. Oh, I see. Oh, look at how pretty. Oh, and it goes over the chair. Yeah. Yes. So look at that, guys. <laughs> look at the workmanship with that. Look, look at how that. pretty that is. Well, put you down, sweetheart. Okay. Look how pretty, Liberty. Yeah. Well, thank you, it's Paula. very colorful. Look at thank that, guys. You, oh, and we like lots of colors. Look at Liberty that. Liberty says thank you, Paula. Paula. Thank you, Paula, for giving me this little guy. I can't lift her right now. She already said it. Okay. Yeah. I like the fringe, too. I love the fringe. Oh, my gosh. That is so nice, Paula. I wish that was a poncho. <laughs> because I love ponchos. It's so nice. I wish I knew someone who could make me a poncho. It took many hours to do it. I even took the church with me and sat there and worked on it in church. A lot of work went into that. It's awesome. Thank you so much, Paula. We really appreciate we this. We really, don't even understand. Yeah, we love little blankets it's and so stuff like that. It's so beautiful, and our kids are going to love it. Yeah, we are. They're probably going to take it off the chair to cover up with it. Um, I can't even believe how beautiful this is. It's amazing, Paula. Thank you so it's much, amazing. Paula. So Next week, we're going to do some auctioning on this jewelry that Paula sent for Amy's fund. So we'll put it away because we have everything set up for this week. So next week, we'll do all this stuff. Thank you again, Paula, for all the stuff that Thank you sent. Thank you so we, much. We are very, very yes. grateful. <laughs> I, it's <laughs> she awesome. She was dying inside to send it to us. It is Aww. awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you, Paula. That was a nice... Uh, Gift. Okay, that was a good start. Yes, Polly is awesome, that's for sure. Um, what are we gonna do first? We've got a uh, makeup box we need to bid on. We have a craft box we're gonna bid on. We have jewelry. We got tons of jewelry. We've got tons of clothes. We've got purses. We have a lot of stuff. So, um, we got some photo albums, we got some slippers. We've got some, we've got LuLaRoe leggings. Yes, we do. Yes, yes we do. We do. Um, what else do we have? And next week, we're going to have a ton of uh, 2X and 3X LuLaRoe clothing. Brand new. So you guys are going to want to check in with us on that. So, so what do you think we should start with, you guys? Um... Are we starting with makeup? Are we starting with a beauty box? Are we start? What are we starting with? The little row leggings. What do you guys think? What you guys think? Throw some ideas. What you what you what you what think? What you think? What you what you think? What you what you what you what you what you what you think? I'm gonna take a sip of wine, a sip of vino, while you guys are deciding. Yes, the vino girl here. Makeup says Sharon. Okay. You're starting, still trying to figure out. Yeah, Jet's difficult because Jet's 11 going on 18. So he doesn't, he's into gaming right now. He doesn't really, he's into baggy pants. He's, you know, he's just, a, he doesn't know what he likes yet. So um, anything, jewelry, purses, makeup. So let's start the makeup box. Let's do the makeup. So we have a medium sized priority box full of makeup and jewelry. Uh, more makeup than jewelry, but we do have some jewelry pieces. We'll throw, we'll, bring, we'll pull some stuff out so you can see. Uh, here, I'm going to show them these, the jewelry pieces. Mom, I want to show oh, my gosh. everybody my cute picture made. Oh, Liberty wants to show her picture she made. Oh, that's... Wow. The so, LOL doll. So she's taking drawing lessons from YouTube, and that's an LOL doll that she that's drew. That's an LOL doll that Liberty drew. It is amazingly good. She takes after her parents in the art section, that's for sure. So... Oh. <laughs> Looks good. Good job, sweetheart. 
The first thing in the box, you guys, is this. Isn't it amazing? She just copied. She's good at copying like her parents. So the first thing is this really pretty like tiara looking headband, which I absolutely love. It's a little bling bling. And then there's a strand of faux pearls that you can wrap if you want. And there's a bracelet and a pin, a pin and a bracelet and another pin. Oh, I wonder what you put in that pin. That looks like you could hold something in that pin. I don't know. I don't think it comes in there. It's cool anyways. Oh, these earrings are really pretty. Look at these earrings, you guys. They're little loop earrings. And this is a whole set of combs, which being a hairstylist, these are really good combs, you guys. It's a whole set here. Yeah, it's a lot of combs. <laughs> that's oh, a lot of combs. That, that one goes there. right there. Yeah. Yeah, that's a lot of combs. And I think they might even be, I'm not gonna say anything. They look like pretty good quality though. Yep. Really good quality back combs and all that kind of stuff in there. Okay, and then. Oh my gosh, look at this compact. Little compact mirror. Is that a mirror? Yep. Look how pretty that is. Looks like a little purse. Look how cute that is. Love it. Some. Is this air freshening spray? Yep. Air freshening spray. Oh, now, now we're getting into the nitty gritty of it. Black <laughs> cherry. Black cherry. Oh my gosh. These eyeshadows. This eyeshadow. So look, look at the colors, you guys. Look at the colors. How pretty is that? Okay. So first we're just going to show you what's in the box and then we're going to. Right. Are you going to start bidding if you want? You can start bidding. If you guys um, want to start bidding. Bid. That started at 25. Starting at 25. So. Sublime Bronze Set Tinted Self Tanning Lotion, and it comes with free Summer Express Grab and Glow Gift Set Instant Tan Body Makeup Lotion. So that sounds awesome. Um, some kind of Kylie. Oh, Kylie Kylie Jenner uh, lipstick. So the Mason Miss the Mess Miss Jess. She Jess. started big. Mess, okay. Um, oh wow, Sonia Kashuk bronzer this this box you guys this box is like oh lenora's at 50 look at already. this look at this and it's that full it includes the shipping it's full. too so whatever it sells for shipping is is included top coat which everybody always needs lenora's already taken the bid at 50 eyeliner. Hours. uh another eyeliner in brown a couple eyeliners in brown i mean so we got we got a 50 dollar bid here already so Got a whole set of brushes. Oh, the set of brushes. Oh my gosh, you guys. The whole, this is like two sets of brushes. Look at how many brushes. Look at all these brushes. Some foundation. Foundation. Whoop. I'm throwing stuff everywhere. And then we've got this other awesome palette in here, which is more the nudes. Oh, huh. It's called In the Nude. It's more nudes. Yes, so it's In the Nude. And this is the other palette that's in there. Along with all the other stuff that I've been mentioning, there's an e.l.f. Um, palette, small palette, but it's got, it's, it's slightly um, used. Yeah, I think it's a tester, so. It's a tester, so, but it's got some really pretty colors in it. It can be sanitized with some alcohol swabs. Um... Bunch of Wet n Wild eyeshadows, tons of Wet n Wild eyeshadows, Wet n Wild lip gloss, lip gloss, EOS uh, chapsticks. Here, hold on. I want to see this eyeshadow palette. Put that right there. Show that. Okay, there's those colors in this eyeshadow palette, and then there's this eyeshadow palette that's in there. It's two little pretty colors, kind of roses. There's this little one here, Lancome. Oh, there's a little Lancome one. Those are great colors together. Peach. And Peach Lip Balm. Yum, yum. Bare Minerals. It's closed Oh, up. Bare Minerals. Medium. 
So this is a chock full box. We're we're at fifty dollars, I think. Yep, we're at fifty. Anybody anybody want it more than? So Lenora's a high bidder at fifty dollars, guys. Lenora on that really big box. This box. All this stuff we just showed you. It is a full box of makeup. Chock full. Chock full of some good stuff. Just the palettes alone, you guys, would probably be fifty bucks. Right, and then you've got the brushes. The brushes alone would probably be fifty bucks. And there's a some jewelry. Um, just throw it in there. We'll try I'll to organize it later. Good. It was gonna drive me nuts if I didn't get it organized. Right. I mean, these are really nice brushes. This is a nice heavy pearl necklace. It's an older vintage one. These combs. I don't. I don't remember how much these combs cost, but this is a nice set. So there's a lot of nice stuff in here, guys. This is probably thirty dollars right there. This probably. Okay. So. Yeah, everybody, give a thumbs up. We we would we'd appreciate that. So I think we're we're staying at fifty. We got no, any, nobody any, else is interested in the makeup box. Nobody else is interested in higher than fifty. That's a good box. I mean, just the the self tanner and and one of the palettes alone is fifty bucks. Right. This uh, this sublime bronze looks really cool. If I was into tanning, this looks like it would. There's sixty. Be great. Sixty at ginger. Ginger ducats at sixty. So everybody, if anyone's new, at the way that we do this is it's it's an auction right now. You say how much you want to pay. And you want to make sure that you email us. Our email address is at the top of the... Right at the... It's pinned at the top of the chat? Pinned at the top of the page of the chat. So um, just email us so we get your email address so we can make sure we can invoice you. Right. I had a lady last week or, or the week before that bought a bunch of stuff and I never got an email from anybody. So I can't it kinda, sell... It kind of is a little annoying because that was stuff that someone else could have picked. Yeah. But instead she picked it and then she never paid for it. So... Right. We just want to make sure that we get everybody's email address so we can make sure and invoice you. And then you get your stuff. Right. If you, you know, you, if know? you, if you bid on something and you, you wanted it, obviously, and then you don't get it because, you know, you lose out. And that's not fun. All right. So we're $60 right now in this box. Right. It does suck because there's stuff in there. Well, I just think of the people that wanted the stuff that they bid on or look, they I, decided they wanted. But I'm, then, what I do know? is. I do invoice through PayPal. Yes, yeah. So through PayPal. email me and I can email you an invoice through PayPal. Yep. Um, I hold on to the stuff a couple weeks, hoping that maybe they'll remember. And then um, after that, it goes right back into the right back into the sales stuff. So, but it is kind of a pain. So we're at $60. High bigger bidder is Ginger Ducket at $60. Um, anybody else interested in that makeup box? It's quite it's quite the, the box. Huh. Correctly. Correctly. Yeah. Yes. It's, it's, uh, I didn't want to say it was rude, but. Some people just don't, they don't think about it, I think. And then when they're done with the, with the lives done. They're like, they're, oh, I spent too much money. Or they don't even think about it, you know. Yeah, we are on Facebook. We have a repurposeful website on, on we Facebook. We don't really go on but there. We like to do all our stuff through PayPal because it, we can ship it through PayPal. We can print off the labels through PayPal, and you can track it through PayPal. So right. it's easier for everybody on that on that note. So. And it would be just another Facebook would just be another thing for us to keep up with that Absolutely. we yeah. don't really have time for. Right. We're we're trying we're trying to keep up with everything, but now that this is our full time business, it right. it's uh, well it's been his full time business for at least six months now, well almost a year. Yeah. And now Almost it's, a year. And now it's the family affair. Oh, no problem, Amy or Cindy. Just send me the... If you still have the email that I sent out, giving the amount, just send a money order check. It's uh, the box is tucked under the Now, thing. shipping isn't included with everything. Just right. when we show you a priority mailbox, right. the shipping is included. We'll shipping, let you know if shipping is included. Right. Shipping is included on the bid, the boxes. Like this box, shipping is included, and the craft box shipping will be included, which is why I started at 25 because it then that's Otherwise, pretty much shipping. shipping is not included. Otherwise, in right. Otherwise, we'll add all your stuff up. I'll pack it in a box, see what it fits in, and give you the best shipping price I can possibly do as a you know regular person. So... Um, 
We have a $60 bid on that makeup box. Do I have anybody else interested in anything higher than $60? Should we go in once? All right, so Ginger Duckett, you are a high bidder at $60. Going once. $60 going twice. Sold. $60. Ginger Duckett. Congratulations. This is a really great box. You've You're going to nice love it. box. Yep. So I will write $60. Lots of fun stuff in there. And I'll write your name on it and wait for your email. Yep. We'll wait for your email, Ginger. Thank you. Welcome to our sale. Yay. Right. Okay. That's that one down. Anybody that knows makeup knows that 60 bucks for a box full of makeup that big is like a steal of a deal. All right. So... That's the only one I didn't forget. Oh, it's okay. Resend it. I, it's okay. We always Helen. keep stuff for like a week or two, just right. just I, in case something happens. I have your stuff right here, Helen. So just email me and you're good to go. You want to keep adding more? So I will tell you guys though that if you buy one item, it's gonna be it's gonna be expensive. Um, if you just buy um, one item, shipping is not included. No, so. If you buy more than one item, it's easier. I can stick a whole bunch of stuff in a box and then send the whole box rather than paying, you know, 10, 15 bucks for one item. So, so okay, just so everyone's not confused, the only time shipping is included is when we do a box right. and it's in a priority box. I will tell you this includes shipping. Yeah, otherwise, we'll tell you it includes, not. otherwise you pay shipping. Right. So, and I'll usually email you. Like, if you, you bid on one shirt and a thing of coffee, I'll email you and say, hey, do you want to ship this now and spend the $10 to ship it, or do you want to wait until next week and add stuff to it so you get a bigger savings? So, I'll, I'll try to... I do what's try good to for cut you, you guys, a deal. Actually. So. That's Okay. I understand. That's why I, I tell you guys it's better to buy more things than just one. It's not worth shipping. If you spend five dollars on a T-shirt, it's going to cost you more to ship it. Right. So you're better off buying. It's going to be bunch like seven ninety nine to ship a five dollar T-shirt. Yeah, at least. So you might as well get three T-shirts, and then seven ninety nine shipping is yeah, like no big deal. Shipping is not what it used to be. Shipping guys, is you know. not inexpensive at all. It's ridiculously overpriced. It's, it is. So. Um, it's funny because we were just talking about this today. Do you remember, what was it that we were talking about? Oh, cars. How when cars first came out, how they were expensive. And then it's kind of like when VCRs first came out, they got cheaper and cheaper. You'd think cars would have gotten cheaper and cheaper, but instead cars have gotten more and more expensive. Everything's more expensive. Does it make any sense? Mailing pouches don't really, they, they, still, they still cost. Unfortunately. For and the that won't fit in a mailing pouch. Yeah. And it'll break. Right. So, craft box, please. Right. It's either, ask Amy. She buys a whole bunch of stuff, and then you get the whole box for, you know, whatever shipping. So, I try to use private mailboxes. We mailboxes. could use a pouch, you guys, but this stuff would break in a pouch. Yeah. That's why it's in a box. Yeah. The the makeup palettes alone would break. Right. I can do, like, t-shirts and clothing in, in, like, a bag, but it's it's still... It's almost as much as putting it in a priority mailbox, so. What's wrong, Liberty? Okay. Guess what? I'm allowed to send the car. Oh, cool. We have a craft box here. Let's do the craft box and get awesome. this done. Oh, so, my gosh, you guys. We're going to show you what's in this box of craft stuff, okay? And this, the bid is going to start at? 25. 25. Hi, Shipping Rita. is included with this. Shipping is definitely included in this with box. With this box. This box only. Okay. Okay. Yay, Amy Craven's getting her box soon. Yeah. It's like Christmas, isn't it? Right. I love getting stuff in the mail. That's why I'm an avid Amazon shopper. Okay. Okay. So this first thing, which I think is so cool, it's called Decorative Touch Wand. And it, it's like a, it's a bedazzler basically is what it looks like to me. It's like a beading bedazzler and it looks so awesome. Um, these really awesome pinking shears, but you can see here's the pattern. It's got like a really fun pattern. 
Travel set of watercolor paints. Travel set of watercolor paints. Um, a stamp that says, I love you in the morning and in the afternoon. I love you in the evening and underneath the moon. Aww. That's a stamp that says that. Oh, we're so glad you liked your boxes, Amy. Yes, we're glad. Everybody Thanks loves Thanks so much shop. for watching. Amy's the one that has her own. Yep. You guys have to tune into her show as well. Um, she does live live um, sales as well. I I think I sent you a, an email, a PayPal invoice already, Don. Do you want to check and look? And then if not, let me know. I'm pretty sure I sent one today. So these are stencil link chalk and wax brush set. Look, they look like stencil brushes to me, but. Yeah. Um, oh, this is a cute little stickers for scrapbooking. Stickers for scrapbooking. I don't know how you got this in that box. What? Or that. What do you mean? They're in their craft stuff. What are you talking about? It's weird because it's that was something that was in my craft stuff. No, it's not. This and this and this. This is from my craft stuff. Anyways, okay. Fine point Bible markers. Drawing, illustration, drafting, graphic design. I'm not sure. Oh, less bleed through, finer flow, and even lines, waterproof. For some reason, they're Bible markers. They just look like really awesome fine point markers. I'm not sure what makes them Bible markers. Maybe if you write in your Bible with them and make, you know, like notes and stuff. Um, lost and found. Wish, create, leave, share. Little um, tags here. Ink pads, stamp ink pads. Ink pads are always good to have if you're into stamping. My labels. Illustrate. They're just things for scrapbooking, I think. Scrapbooking. Scrap, more scrapbooking stuff. Yeah. Hydration light. Oh my God. The Stay Smart Smart Hydration Light blinks to remind you drink every 30 minutes from your last sip. Huh. That's funny. You put that in your bottle and it, it reminds you to drink. Interesting. Um, Fisker's classic stick. Heavy duty cutting for thicker fabrics, batting foam, and multiple layers of fabrics. Gosh, maybe we should have kept that ourselves. That's that's a pretty awesome thing to have. Um, oh my gosh. I am an owl fanatic, by the way. If you guys, I don't know if you knew that. I know that. Who sent, it this, uh, sent us the really awesome owl? We got a guitar and I thought the other one was an owl. Oh, Sharon Easton, the cutouts? Yeah. Was it, the, was it Sharon? It was an elephant. Oh, it was an elephant. Okay. It was Sharon. Okay. Yeah. I love elephants and owls. So if anybody, anybody knows me, they know I love elephants and owls, well, and peacocks. But anyways, um, these are little owl, um, little owl LED lights. Look at how cute that is. Okay. Good job, Don. Thank you. More stickers? More, I don't know, stickers or stamps or something. Yeah. There's a bunch of them in there. A bunch of those in there. Um, style wire for wrapping. Ideal for wire wrapping in there. Oh, if anybody has an S person in their life. Cute little notebook with a pen. Some filament. A zipper. Um, oh, cute stamps. They're like for the office. And these are clip LED lights. They're like clips, but LED lights. Okay. And, oh, an essential oil starter kit. Oh, wow, how beautiful. No, there's nothing in there. I'm not going to put that in there. It's empty. They probably leaked out. Oh, a um, quill pen with ink. Quill pen with ink. Some of that, that awesome tape stuff, you guys. It's Season's Greetings. A little ducky. Oh, a little ducky cutout. That'd be great for a, um, uh, what do you call it? 
When you Easter? celebrate the birth of somebody. Easter. No, well, Easter, but. Oh, yeah. I know what you're saying. Shower. A baby shower. Baby sh sounds like two words. Anyways. Drink more wine. Okay. Babe. Drink more wine. So, All Laura right. says 25. Right, so, we got a $25 bet on this box. You guys seen what was in it? I'll have to repack the box. Now, it, it's, it's full. It's chock full. It's super chock full. Jam packed. I mean, this this right here is probably worth twenty five bucks. This just just this kit. that and a bedazzler. I mean. Yeah. All right. So there's that box, guys. We'll set it up here. Let's do these. What are these cool things? There's fabric. Let's get through this first. Oh, okay. All right. Twenty five dollar bid so far, guys. A lot of you guys said you wanted to see a craft box. Uh, for for bid, so I, I put one together. Carrie's at twenty seven. I've got lots of craft stuff, so if it goes, if it does okay, I'll still do more. But if it doesn't sell for much, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do it. Twenty seven to carry. Right. Twenty eight. Thirty to Sandra. Oh, we got a thirty dollar bid, guys. Thirty bucks. Right, where are the crafters at? Right, where are the crafters? 32. 32 to carry. It's getting there. Carrie Vick said 32. Right, so we're high bid is 32. High bid is 32. There they are. Oh, 35 to Sandra. Okay, it would be seeing what else y'all have, hoping to do a family trip to Florida this summer. Oh, family trip to Florida would be fun. 34 to Carrie Vick. 40. Oh, she's getting serious. She's Carrie, bidding against herself. She's getting... <laughs> well, no, because she saw that someone had already been 35. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, so we're... I made $40, guys. So far, $40. we're at 40 You guys know when you take a trip to Michael's or Joanne, you start putting things in your car. I think Carrie really wants... Oh, Sandra sounds like she wants it more, though. Sandra's got 42. 42 to Sandra. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know why you can't see the other Let's bits. Let's change this to Top Chat. I don't know if that'll make a difference. I just changed it to top chat. If you want live chat or top chat, I thought we did live chat. Carrie Vick, Vick is at forty-five dollars. We are at forty-five. Carrie Vick is. Anybody else? Live chat. That's what I thought. Yeah, we're not. I had it on live chat. All messages are visible, it says. Okay. So they should all be visible. Yep, I have it set to live chat, so there's no reason oh, why Oh, is Rita be. here? Yep. Hi, Rita. Always happy to see Rita. Okay, we're at 45. We're happy to see everybody. Yes. All, all, all the our people. peeps. All the people. Okay. It's so funny because we can see ourselves like real time here, and then we look down here, and it's like afterwards, and it's just funny. Oh, thank you so much, Charlene. Um, it's just funny to see ourselves afterwards. <laughs> I see it all on top chat. Okay, so good. Um, so we're at forty-five dollars from Carrie Vick. Do we have any more bids? We got lots of stuff to get through. We got lots of stuff to get through here, you guys. So. Yeah, lots of stuff. So you guys want to see everything? Hello, Pauline, diving deep in Cincinnati. Well, hi, Pauline. How are you? Okay, we're about to call this box. 
I think we're at 45, right? Yep. I think we're at 45 for the craft box. So going once. 45 going one time. Going twice. And so winner, winner, chicken dinner to Carrie Vic. Carrie Vic. Congratulations. You're going to love this box. All right, Carrie. Just the bedazzler alone I'm excited about. 45 to Carrie Vic. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. We have some cool other little crafty items here too, guys. So we've got these. Oh, they're um, fabric rolls. 20 strips, five designs, four each. I got these out of Joanne. They're probably for quilting or something. Uh -huh. I have no clue. These are really nice. Okay, so here's the first fabric. You can kind of see what the first fabric looks like. It looks like there's another fab. There, it looks like it's like crazy quilt, basically. Right. There's 10 designs. Oh, 10. Two of each design, 20 strips. So it's uh, to make a crazy quilt. If you're into quilting, these would be amazing. Right. Um, so the first one we're going to do, how much? I don't know. What do you think? I don't know Ten what they bucks. sell for. There's no prices on these, so I had no clue. Anybody know what these sell for? I don't want to... I don't, give you... I don't think they're cheap. I think $10 is fair. Let's start them. Let's do them for five each. I think that's what we usually okay, do. Okay, so the first one, is anybody interested? Anybody a quilter? Just... Then we'll move on if nobody's a quilter, because right. that's what this, these are for, I think. I have three... Five dollars each. Them. There's this one, this one. There's a green one, a blue one, and then a, a florally colored Yellow -y. one. Yellowy. Yeah. So, fabric twenty five. Oh, Donna says fabric twenty five, so she's bidding. Okay. Okay. So sell, sell for ten in the store. So we're selling them for five dollars each, Donna. So if you want one of them, just tell me which color you want. Sandy said she'll take all three. Wait, but. Well, we Donna have... says fabric 25. Right. So I think Donna, Donna, did you want all three? Because you're the first one. You're she... the first one to say it. So I have to let Donna let me know if she wants all three for $15, which is what they would be $5 each. This one's really cool. It's got like little moths and stuff. So Donna, let me know. Otherwise, otherwise we're going to do uh, Sandy Marie. Yes. Okay, Donna's going to take them all. She was the first one to bid on them, so um, we're definitely going to do Donna. Make sure you email me, Donna, so we want to make sure you get your stuff. We want to okay. make sure you get your stuff, so email us with your email address so we can make sure we invoice you. All right, so we got them. Right, but D Donna said 25 she was the first one she to say it. She was the first one to say it, so. Yeah. So, she gets them. We're done with these. Now, we're going to move on to, we have a lot of stuff, guys. Should we do some jewelry? Anybody? Jewelry, maybe? I kind of, I, I want to do jewelry. Do some jewelry. Okay. Mama's going to do some jewelry, so. Oh my God. Hello. I should have been wearing this necklace tonight. This like goes with my outfit. Right. Look how pretty that is. So I went to the Goodwill and I got this, um, it's like a hanger and then it has like pockets in it for all your jewelry, which they work really, really well. You guys, by the way, if you're, if you have a lot of jewelry, like, like I do. Um, but this was in there. It was like rolled in there and it's a brand new necklace. It's going to be five bucks. Okay, Amy already said she wants it. I'm surprised. <laughs> Amy loves her jewelry. Let's do the next one. The next one is red. The next necklace is red. And it's very pretty. It's kind of faux stones. And it has some kind of wire wrapping right here. And they're glass, aren't they? Yep. The, yeah, glass. the glass. Yep, Amy. Amy. I knew Amy would go for that. Yep, Amy likes it. It's her. red. So, by the way, Amy, 
this was one of my this is one of my personal i love red as well so i had to i had to clean out the closet mama gets lots of jewelry so, so every some once of in a this, while some of this is every once in a while mama has to go do some cleaning oh this one you guys this one's really lovely it's kind of t twisted right the now. chain is twisted around but you need to jiggle a little bit when you get it did you get the gist of it? The stones are really pretty there. Look how sparkly it is, you guys. And this is only five dollars. What's going on? What? Neck. That's all done. That's the. It says necklace was for me red. No, because Amy, Amy got the green necklace. She said. Then we did the red necklace. See. Necklace red. So Amy was before you, Carrie. Carrie, Amy was before you. She said red necklace before you. If you go yeah. back in the feed. Yeah. So now we're gonna go. We're gonna move on to the sparkly one. All right. So sparkling necklace. Amy Hoosier Amy. Diver says sparkling necklace first. Yeah. That one's really pretty. We got plenty of jewelry. And we'll, They're all pretty. We always have jewelry, so don't worry about if you miss one. There'll be in. There'll be a next one. Trust me. This one is the cloisonne, cloisonne. Oh wow, cloisonne, yep. Yeah. Beads, and it's a really, it's a really beautiful necklace. I don't know how to explain it, but if you like the cloisonne, cloisonne beads, they're like hand painted. Do you see the beads? And little seed beads. Carrie Vicks says necklace beads. Okay. Carrie, you're going to love it. All right. Go ahead. No, she wasn't. I'm not going to sit and argue about stuff. I look at my feed, guys. When I go by who bids first, I look at my feed on my computer, and that's what I go by. I'm not going to sit and argue about it. So, Carrie, you got this one here. We're moving on. Next one. Beaded. Blues, kind of, this seems kind of oceany to me, you guys. Very pretty. Yeah, it looks like uh, when like, the ocean um, takes glass, glass and tumbles it. Yes. Yeah. Like, like ocean glass, like yep. beach glass. Beach glass. Beach glass, that's it. Yep. Isn't that pretty? Now this is, this one is plastic beads, but it looks, it looks like glass. Absolutely does. No bites on that one? No bites. Oh, no, we got it. Carrie Vick. All right, Carrie, you got it. That woman went with my shirt great, too. <laughs> okay, next one, black. Look how pretty that is. This looks like Brighton, you guys. Look at the beads. This is beaded. There's several strands of beads. And, nice and then and a nice big charm. charm. It's so charming. Look how charming that is. Really pretty. Black. Amy, who's your diaper gets it? Black. Got it. Should we try some bling? Some what? Some bling. Sure, bling it out, baby. Let's bling it out. Anybody, like ever, anybody want some bling? Look at how beautiful this necklace is. It's de delicate. I think people's feeds are like slow or something. Oh, yep. Mom. Anything about it? Next one, you guys. Baby. What, honey? Some what? Eggs. Carrie Vick's six necklace. I think eggs. You have you want dinner. a hard-boiled egg? Yeah. She's got dinner that she didn't eat. No, I feel like cooked eggs. You can have a hard-boiled egg. I have one in the refrigerator. All right. Carrie Vick's got that one. Mama's getting Liberty an egg. So she's doing a hard boiled egg. And then we'll be back and do more jewelry. That's good for you too. What's that? She said, I don't know. 
it's good for you too. This one looks like jade. I keep readjusting my shirt. This one would look great with my outfit today too. Look how pretty that is. How did you? How did we know you like jewelry? I don't know. Look how pretty that one is. Looks like jade. I think it's glass. Sea foam green, right? <laughs> ah, right. Look at how pretty that is. Carrie Vic gets it first. Nice. That's yeah, a nice we, one. We, we're trying to be fair, you guys, so we just go by whoever's first on the feed on our feed. That's all we can do. Yeah. All you can do is all you can do. Yeah. I, I think you need to be able to reach over there, and I want to do that one really cool one. Flowery one? Yeah. This one? Yeah. Absolutely. This one's super cool, guys, and I think this one's marked. I think, no, no maybe not. No. One of these was marked something. Look at this one, you guys. That's an amazing necklace. I, it took everything in me to not, I was thinking about keeping it and I'm like, I just have to stop keeping stuff. I can't do it. But look at how many things that would go with. I mean, if I was wearing this today instead of what I was wearing, I mean, hello, look how beautiful that is. Flowers, Amy. Amy. You're going to love it, Amy. It's so pretty. I hate to give that one up. <laughs> it's killing me to give that necklace up. But we know, at least we know it's going but to a good home. we know it's going to a good home. Um, should we do another bling? This one? Yeah, sure. Oh, how about a... How about a, a diamond, diamond choker? Diamonds, you guys. Oh, it's diamonds. Diamonds, darling. You like my diamonds? Diamonds. It's faux diamonds, obviously. But it's really pretty. Yeah, looks like pewter. How pretty that is. Oh, God, Amy. Oh, gosh, Amy. Get that broomstick out. Do they seriously wait till Wednesday? Wednesday must be their regular day. Give them the hose. <laughs> Who's doing the bling? All right. Anybody like the bling? <laughs> okay. We're going to do one more, and then we're going to switch to something else. I like this one. It looks like Amy. Oh, it looks like Amber. This is a very natural looking necklace. It's got some natural colors in there. Oh, Joe says choker. Okay. Gotcha, Joe. So this one has some natural colors and olive greens and things like that. Some kind of amber tones. And it's glass beads. Amy Hoosier Diver says amber first. Sorry, Carrie. Okay. All Guys right. gotta be quick. It's crazy, but we, they, we got we got some people here that are they, they just got their fingers on the on the buzzer on the buzzer. So let's do um let's do Lululemon. All right, we're gonna do some leggings. Let's do some Lula roll leggings next. We got a whole bunch of leggings. Oh, we'll do these real quick. These are cool. Oh, so if anyone's into hair clips. Like this kind, so you wear your hair in a French twist and you clip them like this. Look how pretty these are. I have two of them for ten dollars. We're gonna do both of them for ten. Oh, sorry, your internet keeps going in and out. That's the worst. I'm glad that ours is pretty good. We've had some internet trouble before too. So, yep, last but, week we didn't even get to come on. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We we had internet trouble last week. So, yeah, this, you know, in your hair with the really pretty... She has these for her drapes. <laughs> these are hair clips. And they're super pretty. Look how pretty they are. So, if you wanted, you know, you wanted to put them on the back of your hair and just twist your hair up and throw the clip in, there's two of these. Hair clips. Amy, take them. Amy will take them. All right. They're so pretty, and you're gonna love them. And they're like really well made too. So there's a variety of, of leggings in here. Some of them are Disney, some of them are um, just patterns, some of them are Halloween ish. 
So just remember, guys, they're ten dollars a pair, and they're gonna go quick. So remember that they go fast. So get ready. Cause some of these are probably you can't get them. Some of these are like Disney, Mickey, Minnie Mouse, and Halloween. -y. You can't get them again. Okay, so the first ones we're gonna do. Make sure you see the size first. I already know. Okay. We're gonna do tall and curvy first. Okay, so um, there's one size. One size fits up to size 10. And anything above size 10 is tall and curvy. So the first ones I'm gonna go for are tall and curvies, and they are bones and skulls. Not bones and thugs. Bones and skulls. <laughs> Not bones, thugs, bone thugs and harmony. Oh, look, they match my lips. Right. So that's the first ones. So they're TC2s. And these are all brand new, guys. Oh my God, these are amazing. Beal juice. Got anybody on the, the first ones? Okay, next ones. These are oh, these must be even more. These are TC twos. These are tall and curvies. Shit. What do you mean? Now they made another size. These are these are more. These are tall and curvies. These are these are. Bigger than the tall and curvies. These are TC twos. Doesn't explain the sizing. That's stupid. We really need to get their shit together. Okay, we need to. All right, hold on. We're gonna look up. Let's do the just the regular ones. Let's, where's the TC twos? These ones. These are these. Hold are, up on these first these guys. These are a larger size than than the tall and curvies. I know the tall and curvies are anything above, but they didn't have TC twos. I'm gonna when look. I these, sold. We're gonna look these up real quick. We're looking. We're looking the size up just so we can be informed. Sorry about that, you guys. Two. I've never seen TC2 before. All right. You put the necklaces in the craft box to save on shipping. If they fit. Absolutely. Yeah, if they fit, no problem. Plus size. TC2 leggings measure 38 length, 27 and a half, or 33 waist. Yeah, but what size 50. is... So waist size is 33 to 50 on the TC2. Okay. The TCs are. I didn't look up TCs. Okay, because these are TCs. These are TC twos. These are right. TCs. When, right. I, when I sold the roll leggings, there was only one size, and they came out with the TCs, and the TCs were the plus size. Now the TC twos are beyond plus size. We'll the fridge open. If you're hungry, you can eat your dinner. No! No, I don't want to eat my dinner. It's time for you to go to bed. TCs are 12 to 18. Okay. TCs are 12 to 18, it says. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, 12 to 18. TC2s are the sizes above that. Plus size. So the plus size, the TC2s, guys, are, are like 2X, probably. I mean, look. Those fit. They stretch majorly. So they're 33 to 50 inches. Let's show you the difference between the TCs and the TC2s. You can see the difference. See the difference? These ones back here are TC2s. The ones up front are TC's. So, so if you're a 2X, I would say the TC2s fit you. Yes. So 12 to 18, you said? 12 to 18 on the TC's. So these are TC's. So what do we have TC2s? We only have this Those one are TC2s. And those are TC's. Yeah. Oh, Kirby. Okay. Okay. So TC2... 
TC. These ones are awesome. Look at these guys. Look at those. Spiders. Spiders with Beetlejuice background. Either. Yeah, we were trying to figure the prices. So now that we know what size they are, we're going to... Anybody interested in these? We're going to start We're gonna start on the TC2s. TC2s, $10 a pair. This is the pattern. Bones and skulls. Right. So if you're interested, let me kind know. Kind of stylized skulls. If you're interested, let us know. Leggings. TC2s, they're going to be above size 18. Right, I'm giving these... Your first shot on these guys, because if I put these online, they'll all be gone. Spider leggings, Amy Craven. She wants to start a new box. Okay. okay. Amy Craven, you, the spider leggings are yours. Okay. We got anybody on the bones and um, skulls, the orange bones and skulls. I wish these fit me, you guys, because they would so be mine, because they have skulls on them and bones, and they're orange. I love orange, by the way, if you didn't notice by my lipstick. Kind of fun I can like wear what I want to wear now and do what I want to do and be who I want to be oh I wonder if they do glow that would be great if they glow oh, in the I dark I doubt that they do okay so the next ones are I think these are one size yep the next ones are one size so these go up to size 12 and these are looks like where the wild things are to me I'm not sure why I didn't think to keep these because Where the Wild Things Are is my absolute favorite book in the whole world. It's my absolute favorite book so much that I want to get the words from, I want to quote the book. Please don't go. I'll eat you up. I love you so. So these are from Where the Wild Things Are and they're one size. I might get to keep them after all. Um, I'm not sure, Carrie. Maybe five? Don asked if you got her email. I can't check the email right now because I'm on live on the phone. But I'm pretty sure if you sent it to me, I got oh it. Oh my God, you guys. These are so beautiful. These are TC2s. Look at them. Those are cool. Oh my God. I'm in, I'm so in love with these. Look at this pattern. These are so me. Someone, please get these. If these were one size, look how pretty those are. Those are cool. Okay, okay, Amy gets them. Okay. Gotcha, Amy. Next ones are one size, and they're... Mm, that is... Minnie Mouse? Yeah, because she's got a flower in her head. Minnie Mouse. A little bit different than we usually see her with the bow, but she's got a little hat with a flower, and they're kind of purples with red. It's Minnie Mouse, one size. And the next ones are Minnie Mouse. One size. Paula, they're not Look gonna, at these ones. These are one size, Paula. These are uh, one... Uh, they go to size 12. So, oh, size are 12. These are size 12. These aren't plus size No, ones. two size 12. So, they stretch to size 12. Right. One size. We got no one size... People in the house. Minnie Mouth Bo says Patty Joe. Okay. Patty Joe gets Minnie Mini Mouth. Patty Joe, you're on. You made it on. I think I might. So All no right. one on these ones. Patty the skulls Joe and the bones. got on. So we'll put these on online. Yep. All right, we're gonna do some. More. We're gonna do some other stuff here. Hold on a minute. Just close. Huh? Just too close. We too close. Get more close. Yeah, they don't seem like they're super interested. Maybe they're just on the leggings. Okay. Because those didn't sell. Right. Put them over there because we'll sell them. Um. I let's let's do these. Anybody do knitting? Oh, how about uh, with a. Knitting with a loom. Any more one sized? Nope, not right now. We might have a bunch more next week, though, guys. 
I'm working on something. Knitting loom set for hats. Quick knit, easy to use. Look at how cool this is, you guys. I have a loom, I did it for scarves, and it's really fun. And even my son, who's 11, tried to help me with it. It was pretty fun. Are these my, these are my looms. No, they're not. Are you yeah. sure? Yeah. I had round looms like this. I had two of them. Your looms are all with the craft stuff. This is stuff that I found Better in the not trash. be my looms. These are all in the trash. I'm gonna be the first Actually, time he's trying to sell my stuff. These came from the thrift store trash. He's trying to sell my stuff, no, I'm just kidding. Anyways, so this is really cool because it can make two different size hats. And then we got another one that can make two different size hats. And you can find the instructions online. They're really, really easy to use. It's just literally, you just gotta get this little hook thing and you weave it in between and <laughs> and it'll make you a hat. It's so amazing. So who's interested in this stuff? We Nobody. don't have too many crafters tonight. No, apparently not. What else we got? What else we got? What else we got? What do we, what do we got? What do we got? Let's do some person. Oh my God. So I don't know if you guys know about Longenberger, but this is Longenberger purse. And that's not all. Inside of it, if anybody knows about Longenberger, you know that it's all about the accessories because you get the basket and then, oh, the price of the looms. Oh, you need to know the price? Good, good point. The five, looms five bucks are $5 a piece. <laughs> I got excited about him because I thought that he was trying to sell my looms. No. So, um, Longenberger, anyways, you, they're they're predominantly baskets. Okay, Joe wants the looms. Okay, both gotcha. both sets of looms, Joe. I'm guessing because she said looms, yeah, plural. Okay, Longenberger. Okay, we got you, Joe. Longenberger uh, baskets. You buy the basket and you buy the liner and all this. They don't make them anymore, but you still find them every once in a while. I'm so sad that they don't make them anymore. But here's the purse, and it also comes with. This plastic liner that goes inside of it that makes it stiff and makes it so that it stays open better. Isn't that cool? So this is a little, I, I thought about keeping this one for myself because it's a little bit, a little bit rockabilly. Paula, you're going to love it. Paula wants it. Okay. You know what almost matches that is this bracelet. It's like the same colors. Okay. Let's do this one. Oh my gosh. So this is a cinch purse with a with a tassel. And it has cherries on it. Big basket carpet office is for sale. Hmm. So the oldest water drove the company into the ground. The what? The oldest daughter drove the company into the ground. Oh, really? It's usually what happens, gets given to the kids, and the kids drive it into the ground. Right. It was such a good... Uh, I love those baskets, Longenberger baskets. Right. I'm probably pronouncing it wrong, but... This is the next purse, you guys, if anybody's interested in that. It's got cherries, and they're sequin. They're not sequins, but they're beaded. This is all beaded and embroidered, and it's a cinch top. And great for an evening, you, you guys. Great evening bag. can be like... A shoulder bag or it can just be I, if I wore this I would like wrap it around my wrist and just keep it around my wrist maybe this would be great for the Renaissance Festival yep and it's kind of rockabilly it's, it's very rockabilly because it's got cherries on it yeah so 15 on that one. Oh, 15 on this okay let's go next Keep that in mind if anybody wants that, it's 15. Here's Make sure I let you know what the price is. Here's a small Kate Spade. Oh, how about a small Kate Spade? It's got a little bit of the Kate Spade print. And this one is... Not all of them are. Not all of them. This one is 15. Yeah. Most of them start at 25, but the smaller ones I sell smaller. Like that one there, I'll probably start at, I'll do, start at 15. This one starts at 15. Oh, too bad. I hate it when people lose their jobs. So purses are all auctions, too, guys. So whenever I say a purse, it you it's forbid. 
just a little stiff. Probably needs some oil. I don't think it's... I think it's broken. I think it's broken. That one's broken. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's do, I got a good one for you guys. How about this little coach? Oh, this one is so cute. It's a crossbody. You guys, I love crossbody purses. It's a coach purse. This is 25. This is a great purse. Why am I not? This would have been way better than the purse I'm carrying right now. Great crossbody coach purse. Starting at 25. Anybody? Anybody awake? We have 62 people in the house. Rita says coach. 25. Okay. All right. Rita says 25. All right. So Rita's at 25. Anybody else want to bid more? Coaches are purses are all auctions as well, guys. So, well, if you want to send any of, you, any of your Longenberger baskets to me, I can give you my address. We got thirty. We got from thirty on this. Thirty-two. Thirty-five to Rita. 35. We're at 35 to Rita. Rita likes her coach purses. She's got quite the collection from us. Okay, so I think we're at 35. Yep, 35, Rita Farley. Oh, um, 36 to Charlene. Oh, there we go. 36 to Charlene. We're at 36. Anybody else? 36. I've got to tell somebody about this. 37, Rita. Rita's not letting go of this black purse. It's two, too, because this coach purse has the, it's kind of wearing off, but it's the emblem with the coach, with the buggy and rider. Oh, someone. There is a lag. 37 to read out. Charlene's at 38. You got 38 so far. Anybody else? 38 going once. Nope, Rita's at oh, 40. Oh, Rita's at 40. We're at 40 now. <laughs> Rita really wants this. It's a crossbody. I really want it too. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. Okay, we're at 40 now. I need a fan in here. Well, there we go. It just feels hot in here. Charlene says Rita has it. So Charlene has given up on the purse. So... We're Anybody? at 40. We're at 40. Anybody else? Forty going once. Twice. Sold to Rita. There it is. Whoop. All right, there Rita. It is. You're gonna love this purse, Lita. Rita. Lita. Lita. Why a, did I say Lita all of a sudden? It's a cute little purse for sure. Rita. Can't talk tonight. Okay. Now Sorry you're having coach. a leg. That's so fun. There's another coach purse. Look at this little gray oh, one. Oh my god, this one is so, the leather on this is so soft. And this vintage. is a vintage one too, because look at the clasp. I have a couple with this clasp. And they are from um, the early... Probably the 90s, I would say. No, they're from the early 2000s. Are they? Yeah, when I first moved here, I had a purse that had it's that It's got a little buckle. wear on the leather, because it is real leather. This is real leather. So it's got a little bit of wear on the leather. But... <laughs> right? Auctions are fun. They are. This gray, though, is so sumptuous. This gray purse would go with anything, I'm telling you right now. And this clasp is like the coolest thing ever. It is. What's the inside color? Oh, look at oh, that color on the inside. blue. And it's not navy blue. The pictures doesn't it's show it does. It's sapphire blue. It's oh, oh, no, it's like peacock blue. Yeah. It's my favorite color. It's peacock Pe blue. Yep. Yeah. 
Wow, with gray? Right, $25 start. And then it has this zipper section here as well. Amy says 25. All right. Started off at 25. 25 for this lovely gray sumptuous leather purse. You guys, this purse is like amazing. I'm salivating over it, just looking at it. The <laughs> fact that it has that blue on the inside, it's like, so me. Mm. There she goes. Just what I needed. I need another purse like I need to hold that. <laughs> what are we at? We're at 25? We're at 25. Nobody else loves this purse as much as Amy? Because I guess it could be Amy's then. Because this purse is amazing, Amy. You'll love this purse. So we're doing 25, going once, 25, going twice, 25. Sold. Sold. <laughs> All right, it's yours. Amy gets it, 25. Congratulations, you win. You're gonna love this purse, it's so soft. The leather on it, it's just amazing. This is one they like, made leather and stuff so soft and supple. Soft right. and supple. Okay, so. It puts the lotion in the basket. So this purse comes with a little coin purse. Now, you're gonna think right off the bat that it's Louis Vuitton, but it's not. This is actually a Laney purse. I've looked them up there. They sell purses all the time. So if you want that Louis Vuitton look, it's not a fake Louis Vuitton, because you're not allowed to do that. This is actually a Lane, Laney purse. They sell them like this. But it looks just like a Louis Vuitton, and it also has a little coin wow. purse to match. So, we are going to sell this one for 25 bucks. So you have this and the coin purse, twenty five dollars. If you want that Louis look, Carrie Vicks at twenty five. You're gonna love it, Carrie. It's a great purse for the price. It looks just like Louis Vuitton, and it's brand new. Doesn't look like it's got any wear at all in it. Rita's got a closet just for purses. I bet you do. I wish I had a closet for purses. I could use that. I have no idea where to put my purses. Anybody else interested in this purse for 25? Looks like Carrie likes it. Carrie likes it. Got a $25 bid from Carrie Vick going once. 25 going twice. Sold. Carrie, you got yourself a lady. Carrie got it. 25 bucks. All right. Congratulations. Okay. Sweet. What else are we doing? Um, well, we've got some nice Vera Bradleys. Anybody interested in some really... You guys want to see some Vera Bradleys? That Rita has one side of the closet plus a lot of clothes by my bed. Just clothes. I had a lot of clothes by our bed, but I was hoping in this house I wasn't going to have to do that. But my clothes aren't fitting in the closet, so we're going to have to figure something out. Okay, so <clears throat> I've never seen <clears throat> a, a Vera Bradley duffel bag. <clears throat> so, look at this, guys. Vera Bradley duffel bag. How it's cute a is that? duffel bag, which you don't see things like this, so... $25 start on this bag. And it's literally just a tufted duffel bag. It's got like a plaid inside. You can see here the Vera Bradley tag. It's a really nice bag and it's very colorful. So anybody interested in this bag? 
Vera Bradley, $25 to start. Nice and colorful, guys. Oh, it has a pocket here. It does have a pocket on this side, not on the other side, just this side. Anybody else? Anybody? Anybody? Still got a lot of stuff to cover. <laughs> Amy, you're funny. Nobody interested? I'll put it online. I just thought I'd give you guys a shot first. Yes. All right, Donna, click. $25 start. Anybody else? I have a 25. All right, I have a 27. Carrie Vick is at 27. We're at 27 on this bag. This is such a nice bag, you guys. It's really great, nice. Great weekender overnight bag. I see lots of Vera Bradley bags. I've never seen a duffel. Never seen a duffel bag. And it has really nice long straps. This is great for travel, you guys. It's great. And I it's... feel like duffel bags, their straps are never like right, the right length. These are like perfect. They're just right at the right length. It's nicely colorful, too. All right, so anybody else? 27 is the high bid, Carrie Vick. I just noticed. 28. See how the trim goes around the end? There's like a trim trim pattern right there. Looks really cute. All right, we have a $28 bid from Donna. I thought you guys would have been fighting over this. Had to make, I had to make sure I got my lid for my wine glass because my wine glass tends to get fruit flies in it. All right, Carrie, Donna's at 28. Are you going to let her have it for 28 or are you going to outbid her? It's a nice bag. All right, Carrie is letting you have it, Donna. Donna, it's all yours. Congratulations. You're going to love this bag. It's so beautiful. Okay. It's Vera Bradley for crying out loud. I mean, right. come on. $28. Donna, you got it. So pretty. All right. Your name on it. Bam, bam, thank you, ma'am. Okay, what else we got going on here? Are we done with bags, guys? What else are we doing? Should we do some candles? You guys want to do candles? You guys want to do candles? We got some candles. Anybody want candles tonight? Otherwise, we have other stuff. I love that you guys are so kind to each other. That's great. More, Amy says more jewelry. <laughs> she can probably see what we have in the back. Yes, right. candles. Yep, a carry-on for a flight. Perfect size for carry-on for a flight. And it would double as a head pillow. <laughs> yeah, it would, wouldn't it? It's round. Well, we can do some candles. Let's do some candles. All right, we're going to do some candles, guys. How about Tiki Beach? Vanilla and coconut. I got to smell this one to make sure that it's vanilla and coconut. Oh, my God. It smells so good. It smells like vacation. That's what they, you know what? Why wasn't Greg on this one? You should have just called it vacation. It, they should have just called it vacation. But what do they know? First one, Tiki Beach, vacation, uh, vanilla and coconut, hello. For all you new people out there, these are $5 a piece. They're usually uh, Bath and Body Works candles, and I just take them out of the glass, clean them up a little bit, chop them into bits, and I sell them in bags for 5 bucks each. So. so when we sell them in bags, you can take them yourself, and Carrie Vick wants it. Okay. You can take them and just... Break a chunk off and put it in your in your wax burner, which works great. Or if you want to melt them down and make your own wax burner, or wax uh, melts, or your own candles, it's up to you. But I just take I just 
you know, just stab a chunk off and I put it in my wax burner and they work great. So, so that's what you can do with them. And suntan, citrus, orange blossom, and coconut. Suntan. Mmm, let's smell it and smell what it smells like. That was a good one. I remember that one. We, are, we just did these today. We just literally just chopped these up this afternoon. So we got the Which smell. Which was funny these. because Bath and Body Works likes to like destroy the candles. And this one was like chopped up for us already. It was pretty funny. Right. Well, thank you for chopping it up. Yep. Literally suntan. It reminds me of um, banana boat or... Banana boat coconut oil from the 80s. It smells delicious. Okay, moving on. Platinum. It smells very clean. It almost has a men's cologne, but not a strong men's cologne. It's very clean smelling cologne. Very clean smelling. So right now we have suntan and, oh, him and I decided that it smells like after, after the shower. So like when it smells like men's cologne and it's, there's the steam and it's, it smells like a, a man's shower, like that clean scent, you know, that's what, that's what this um, platinum one smells like. Should I do any more? <laughs> Where's everybody at? Can everybody still see us? Cause I'm not getting any more, any more Vera. Yeah, but that was like a while ago. Are we in lake? Asleep, right? Is everybody there? Silver platinum. Oh, yes, yes. platinum. If you're new to our, our um, show, our show, listen to me. Just wishful thinking. Our sale. <laughs> um, Chris K is bored. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, we're boring. Um, I'm trying to be boring. Um, if you're new to our sale, make sure that you uh, email us. Our email is pinned to the top, right? right? So the mess, Miss Jess, you said suntan platinum. You want them both or $5 each? Because one is suntan and one is platinum. Well, I'm sure you have a ton, Amy. Right. I am so happy that we're finally caught up on our candles because we had bins and bins of them. Thanks, Paula. Paula says thumbs up, please. Thank you. Okay, I think she wanted both those candles. Well, she's not saying oh, she's that. She's not responding, okay. Let me know if you want them both. Okay, next one. Yes. Okay, she likes them both. I gotcha. Crushed candy cane. It smells exactly like that. My second auction tonight, night, long evening. <laughs> okay. We got you, Mess Miss Jess. All right, Miss Jess, we got you on both of these candles, okay? Yeah, we got you. We got you. Okay, next. Next one is crushed candy cane. It smells exactly like crushed Candy canes. I wanted to eat the candle. Which, by the way, Paula gets it. Um, candy canes, we were having this discussion today. The only time candy canes taste good is when they're crushed up into something, in my opinion. Like chocolate? What do you guys think? Like chocolate bark? Like, uh, like a chocolate bark with the, the candy cane crush, which is one of my favorite things right now because we have some from Christmas, and they're really awesome. Okay. Cedar wood and amber. You guys, this is amazing. This one's amazing. Oh my god. Cedar wood and amber. I mean, just uh just amber alone. Let alone throw a cedar. Yes, and hot chocolate for sure. We get you know we got these spoons that are candy cane spoons for your hot chocolate. Yeah. I don't know where we put those, but we need to. Yeah. 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 Cedar wood and amber is the next one. If you like that clean kind of masculine, okay, Paula, Joe. Patty Joe. Patty Joe. Oh, Patty Joe. I can't. Sorry, I don't have my glasses on. So if I call someone the wrong name, it's because I don't have my glasses on and I'm blind without them. I wanted to look good. I, I, I am went for really excited that you finally got in, Patty Joe, and, and we're, um, are able to get some stuff because you've been trying for a while. So that makes me happy. Good. good oh, job. Easter peeps and hot. Oh, 
God, I gotta go get some peeps, if there is any left. Sugar no more, so I cannot have my candy cane and hot chocolate. Oh, They have sugar-free candy canes and hot chocolate, I'm sure. Sugar-free candy canes. Oh, they sugar-free stuff still tastes good. Um, I eat sugar-free stuff all the time. Red apple is the next one. Work will knife you at their dumpster. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to see one of them get to the dumpster with a knife for me. I couldn't even see y'all on my computer screen. <laughs> nice. Dried out Easter peeps. <laughs> we probably have some Easter peeps left from last year. Probably. I gave a lot of them away. Remember? You know what Easter peeps taste really good in? Easter peeps taste really good in... Um, s'mores. In s'mores. Absolutely. Yep. That's all they're good for. The candy, the birthday cake. Why is my brain not working today? The birthday cake ones. Apple. We have no peeps. Nope. Sorry. We're just talking no. about them because it's Easter time. Coming up here. I can't stand peeps. They're good in s'mores and that's it. They're good. Okay. Uh, who said apple first? Joe. Joe said apple. Okay, good. Citrus burst. Now we have a couple of, we have like three or four of these citrus bursts. So citrus burst smells really good and these fresh. These are really they nice. They smell so good, you guys. Citrus burst. Okay. I'm going to do citrus burst. I think we have like five of them. So if you guys want citrus burst, let me know. Right? Five, one, two, three, four. four. Probably another one in there. All right. Paula wants one. No, there's six. Oh, yeah. There's six of them. I told you. All right, so Paula's got one. Now we have one, two, three, four, five. I got five left. Citrus burst. We have five more citrus bursts. So if you guys are interested, just say it on the screen, and we'll, we'll start going through the other ones. But if you remember you want one, let us know. All right, Joe wants one. I knew we'd sell them. All right. Mess Miss Jess wants one. Sandra wants one. I knew we'd sell these suckers. These are oh, great. Oh, this is just for us, you guys. They're so refreshing. All right. Sandra... Okay. Okay, we got two more left if anybody wants. I'm just letting you know. But we'll move on and do more. Next one is fresh cut roses. And you guys, if you've smelled fresh cut roses, this candle smells exactly like fresh cut roses. It's pretty good. Like, you know how fresh cut roses smell green? They smell like green fresh cut roses. And they're, it's just, it's, it's so good. So fresh cut roses is the next candle. I gotta smell it again. It's just crazy. It's just crazy that they can make a candle like that. Carrie right. Vick gets it. Carrie, you're gonna love it. It's like it is amazing. It's like literally it's like I just brought fresh cut roses in the house for her anniversary. It's what it smells like. It's so amazing. It's crazy. So Carrie gets the fresh cut roses. Wow, I can't believe it. It's like in the air right now and it smells like real roses. We still have two citrus bursts left. Right. Vanilla balsam. Cadbury cream eggs in the USA, they are my favorite Easter treat. Oh my god, yes, we do. Yes, we have Cadbury cream eggs and they are delicious. They're smaller than they used to be though. Back in the yeah, 80s, they everything's, were huge. everything's smaller now. Even the Twinkies are smaller now. <laughs> and it's not because I've gotten bigger. It's because everything's getting smaller. And I don't like it. Okay, so the next one is vanilla balsam. Anybody interested in vanilla balsam? Vanilla balsam. We have two citrus bursts left. Still got two citrus bursts left. Oh, I'm knocking my lid off my wine. Be careful. Okay. Next one is Lakeside View. It's water lily, hyacinth, uh, linen. It's very, it's a very clean smell. 
So Lakeside View is the next one. Other two citrus bursts, Paula. Mm. We got a vanilla balsam and a Lakeside View, which is water lily, hyacinth, linen. White Sands, Sugarcane, Nectarine, which I spelled wrong, Sandalwood. I think I spelled Sandalwood wrong too. I'm horrible at spelling. Um, but anyways, Fiji White Sands, amazing smell. Really amazing smell. Oh my God, I want to eat it and I want to lay in it. Yeah. Fiji White Sands, just saying. Yes. This is, smells like a vacation in a bag. Vacation in a bag. If you can't take a vacation, just get a candle and stick your face in it. And then take a bath. White Sands, Patty. Yeah, Patty I love the White you. Sands one. It's really, really, really beautiful scent. Sandalwood, Black Rose. Oh, you guys, this one's very moody. It's, it's very, um, it's Sandalwood and Black Rose. It's amazing. It smells so good. We got to keep one I of these. didn't know that Black Roses having a party cake and cotton candy peeps now. Oh, <laughs> yummy. White Sands. Is that that one? No. Sandalwood and Black Rose. Okay. She already got that one. That's right. Okay. Sandalwood and Black Rose. I didn't know that Black Rose would have a different smell than like a Red Rose. It's amazing though. But it smells really Is good. Is this the one that we still had the whole candle? Yes. Yes. We got to keep yes. one. We got to keep one because we like we like this smell so much. Yes, it's awesome. Okay, Island Margarita. It says it all, guys. Island Margarita. It's it smells like a tropical smells margarita. Like a margarita. I think they're getting bored with candles. You guys getting bored with candles? We got a vanilla balsam laugh. We got a fireside. We got a sandalwood and black rose. Island Margarita left. No, nope, no cherry. No cherry. Pretty soon we're going to be at the point that we, the uh, Isla Margarita one. Pretty soon we'll be at the point that as soon as we find them, we'll be able to sell them because we, we're down to our last bin, which is awesome. We don't like them sitting around. All right. Okay. Black Rose. Where's the Black Rose? I think the Black Rose is... Oh, this one. Gotcha. How about Pineapple Punch? Pineapple Punch. Hi, Angie. Oh, sorry. It's not Pineapple Punch. It's Pink Apple Punch. <laughs> nice I can't even read my own writing, you guys. Nice of you to stop Pink in and say hi, Angie. Apple Punch. Hi, Angie. Pink Apple Punch. Bueller... Ferris. They're saying hi to Angie. Bueller. Everybody say hi to Angie. She always sends us those lovely postcards. I can't believe I said pineapple. It's pink apple. I know we love the postcards. Makes us feel love. Right? At least I got the punch right, okay? It's <laughs> pink apple punch. Punch. Okay, so next one. I still have vanilla balsam left, you guys. Vanilla balsam's really beautiful. I know no one's thinking about winter, but I like winter smells hey. all the time. We like, I know that everybody thinks of like pumpkin pie and candy canes and all this. And holiday. Um, or, uh, yeah. uh, 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 pumpkin spice. We just had a pumpkin pie last week. Yes. And guess Year what? Year round. Cause we we're, will continue to have pumpkin pie. Cause we're summer. crazy trendsetters. That's why. We are. Yeah. We are. Watch us. We be going places. Speaking of which. Tis the season. Cinnamon and sugar cookie. Oh. Are you kidding me? Sugar cookie? Tis the season. <laughs> right? Right? Because there won't be any more I, unless we accidentally find it. I was literally thinking that and I was thinking, oh my God, we're, like, we're moving into summer now. Uh, cinnamon. cinnamon. Tis the season. Got it. Anybody yeah. up for pink apple punch or fireside view, which is water lily, hyacinth, and linen? We also have vanilla balsam. Okay. 
Next one is verbena and orange, and it smells so good. Huh. Yeah, we're probably way behind the times, too. That's Actually, right. we're not. We're pretty up on the on stuff here. Verbena and orange, and it smells very fresh and clean, and, and I want to eat it. <laughs> it's bad when you want to eat candles. What's verbena, anyways? Verbena must verbena. be like an... It's like, yeah, it's a... Flower? Yeah. Oh yeah, so lemony. It literally smells like a bucket of lemons. With orange. With orange. So I still have pink apple punch, lakeside view, vanilla balsam, and now I have verbena orange. Right. And Trendsetters, I have, bam! I have two of the verbena oranges. Verbena oranges, I have two of them. All right, Paula. Sounds grand. Ooh, speaking of fall, how about someone said orange? Joe says orange. Joe, got it. Okay, got gotcha. I have two of them, Joe. If you want both, um, caramel pumpkin swirl. Caramel pumpkin swirl. Yum. Delicious. Um, oh, I'm so sorry if you just got on. We didn't, we didn't explain again. These are $5, and what happens is, is we find broken candles from Bath & Body Works in different places, and we break the glass off of them, and then we put them in a bag, and we sell them to you for $5, and you can take them and melt down to your own candles or wax melts if you'd like, or you can just break a chunk off and throw it in your wax melter, which is what I do, and you got yourself a wax melt. Ready to go. And it's Bath & Body Works candles, and... The home goods and all the great places that sell candles. So, Tressa says lemon, and the other ones you had before caramel. So here's a lemon one. But did did the one person want both the verbena oranges though? No, she didn't say anything. Okay. Orange. She just said orange though. Is so that means she one? wants this one. Oh no, that was behind. I just got her an orange one. Before caramel. Um, Verbena orange, I think. Verbena orange. It was the one before caramel. Okay. You got that one. Thanks, right. Gabby's Goods. We let, we, that's what we let, we try to do is just give a good deal to everybody share the wealth, but we also make a little bit of money for our family because this is our family business. So that's what we're trying to do. We give great deals. And um, anybody um, interested in caramel pumpkin yep, swirl? Sandra, Sandra, oh, we Sandra. already got someone on that one. Okay. Sandra's got it. This one's called Laundry Room. Thank you, Gabby's Goods. I try to look good. I try, I try, I try. Um, the next one's really clean smelling. We we think it smells like laundry detergent or like a just a really clean laundry room. Buy from us anytime. We're always here Wednesday nights. Join us at six o'clock. Yep. Not not always every Wednesday night. Sometimes things happen, but oh, I hope your furnace works. Right. So, laundry room, really clean smelling. It smells like awesome. Okay, Carrie Vic. I, I'm going in the whole description and Carrie Vic's like, laundry. <laughs> that was like, we want you to shut up. Okay. Um. Okay. Okay. Where are we at? Getting down there? Yep, yeah, we're getting down there. Getting Next down. one is lemonade. 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 That's a good one. Yummy lemonade. It's a great kitchen candle. Absolutely. We got lemonade is the next one. Next one is Australian pine. Australian pine. Lemonade. Lemonade. I gotta smell Australian pine and make sure it's good. Just to make sure it's good for you. Oh my gosh, speaking of winter. Mm. 
I feel like I'm gonna buy a fire. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. <laughs> oh, that'd be fun. We don't have we don't have very much room here. It's kind of like, yeah, we're kind of squished in here, but squished. Um, Australian pine. Next one, rose and vanilla, rose and vanilla. And it literally smells like roses and vanilla. And it's not that perfumey rose, it's like a real rose. If I remember correctly. Oh, the heat's broken too, that's no fun. No. Rose. I hope you're not too cold where you are if the heat's broken. The next one is Champagne Toast. If anybody knows anything about Bath and Body Works candles, Champagne Toast is highly sought after. I've been told. I don't know where I was told that, but for some reason I know this. And I'm sticking with it. <laughs> he asked me today, he's like, where'd you find that out? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> I just heard it's highly sought after. It's champagne toast. It just sounds to me like it would be highly sought after because it's champagne toast. And I know that it's, I do know that it's one of Bath and Body Works older scents. Tressa takes it. Tressa takes it. I didn't have to tell her about my... <laughs> oh, another sunset. We have another sunset. Anybody want a sunset? It's clean. Yummy. I still have vanilla balsam. I have Lakeside View, which is water lily, hyacinth, and linen. Very clean smelling. That's got a great fresh smell to it. Pink apple punch. Australian pine. Have you lit? Oh, wow. Gabby, you just got things going on, girl. Okay. I only have two left. I got two left. Oh my gosh, you guys. <laughs> what? <laughs> Amy Craven, I thought, what a strange combo. Champagne and toast. <laughs> okay. It's funny that you say that because the next one is marshmallow fireside. <laughs> Although... It smells like marshmallows when you're making s'mores. Yeah, it does. Champagne and toast together. That's funny. <laughs> it doesn't even sound like a good combination. Uh, Amy, let me tell you. If you live close to us, we would, we'd have a blast. I'm telling you. Okay. And the next and last one is marshmallow puff. Fireside. We already got that. Okay. Marshmallow Puff is the last one. Oh, this smells good. This smells like marshmallows, guys. Yum, 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 yum. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Don't ask me what that just was. Okay. Okay, oh. Australian Pine. Pink Apple Punch. Now we got the crate. We can put them all back in the crate. We got a couple left. That's all we got is a couple left. We sell out of these things. Yeah, guys. we usually sell out of these, so. They all last. And you guys, you guys are bundling up right now. Our Easter weekend. Easter is supposed to be what? 98, 98 degrees. degrees. Not the band. Pink apple punch. It's just really sweet smelling. The pink apple punch is sweet and, and okay. sweet and clean smelling. Pink apple punch. Where? Oh, Someone asked about pink apple punch. Okay. What is pink apple punch? This is what they look like when they come in the bag. So we cut them up. 
Well, we break the glass off, we cut them up, we put them in these bags, which happen to be from Five Below. <laughs> Everything's out of the trash. Everything's Everything we find is from the trash. So these bags happen to be from Five Below, but you got a candle in them. There you go. Um, we take the wicks out if we can. We take the glass off as much as we can. And then you can break a chunk off if you want and throw it in your wax burner, which is what I do because I... We... You know, we went through the whole trouble of making our own wax melts and making our own um, candles. And it was like so much work for so nothing. You know what I mean? Like I can just break one of these off and put it in my wax burner and it smells just as good. Yeah. So why does it have to be pretty? It doesn't have to be pretty. It's going to melt in two seconds anyways. Right. So pink apple punch, uh, sunset, which is a very clean smell. We've already sold one of the sunset. We've got Australian pine. And vanilla, I'm really surprised no one's gotten vanilla balsam because vanilla balsam is pretty bomb. And then lakeside, which is water lily, hyacinth, and linen. Those are the only ones we have left. That is fine. We can put them away for next week. Not a problem. We'll put them away for next week. Yep. We will do just that. And what are we doing? Next week's sale, we'll bring them I out. think we are about done rounding out. Yep. Someone asked about Vera Bradley. Do we have any more Vera Bradley? Did they just ask? No, a while ago. Vanilla balsam. Tressa just asked about this one. Okay. I got you on the vanilla balsam. Tressa. Vanilla balsam's yours, Tressa. Thanks so much for your purchase, everybody. We really appreciate you guys. I hope you know how much we appreciate you guys. We try to move fast and we're not trying to be like like we don't love you because we do we really appreciate you yeah we do car fragrances no. no they're just they're just the the um candles so someone said that they had wanted to see a vera bradley bag are you still on we have one more vera bradley bag if anybody's just one interested more. so let me know if you're interested we have one more vera bradley purse um, if you're interested, I can show you. It has been a long day. And tomorrow, we get up early and go dumpster diving. So we have this one, which is see. really nice. Someone said sunset. Do we have a there you go. called sunset? Yvonne, I don't know. There's the Vera Bradley. This is the Vera Bradley. It's a crossbody. Thank body. you, Rita. Thank you, everybody. Said sunset. I think, I think we sold it. I think we sold it. Okay, so the Vera Bradley purse? It's $25 to start. All purses are auctions. I know somebody asked. I don't know. Someone asked about Vera Bradley okay. purses. So we're going to start this at 25 guys. Look how pretty that is. Look at the detail on that. Really nice. Starting at $25. It's a, it's a bid. So $25 starting. Who wants to start the bid at $25? $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25, $25,
Anybody else on the Vera Bradley at $30 high bid? Okay, 30 going once, going twice, sold, sold to carry. Carry for 30 bucks. Nice job. Okay, you guys. All right, that's it for tonight. Okay, so if you're new to our our sales, make sure that you go to the top. Our email address is pinned. Oh, Mess, Miss, Jess already emailed us. There she is yep, right there. I just, just now. got the email. So thank you. We just want to make sure we get your email so we can invoice you, you guys. Yep. So every, well, good, Carrie. That's awesome. Oh. So everybody email me and I will send out invoices. Sounds good, Patty Joe. Give me a couple days because tomorrow morning we do dumpster diving. So me and the me and the beauty will be out checking those dumpsters tomorrow. So um, probably won't get to it till close to Friday. So um, thank you as always, guys, for buying some stuff. And uh, happy, happy Easter. Easter. And we'll see you next Wednesday. Bye. See you later, guys.